Hey guys, welcome back to the Wine Doc Project 365, episode 1439. Guys, you're following along on YouTube, please jump on over to thewinedoc.com. Check out all of our full length episodes. That is where we house them. Today, what we're doing is reviewing the butt touch drill, uh, which is a drill that we utilize to groove our hip hinge. This is something you guys can do at home. Practicing our hip hinge is essential for both lifting, like dead lifting, or squatting itself, okay? So here's what we're gonna do. We're gonna get ourselves into a position next to a wall, okay? If I'm standing straight up, this is where I am. I'm gonna take one step forward. I'm gonna put my feet at about parallel to where my squat would be, right? So about hip width apart. And then from right there, I'm gonna keep my tummy nice and tight. I'm gonna drop my butt back until I can touch my butt against the wall and stand straight back up. Let me give you a, a larger view now, okay? So, butt comes back, stands up. Butt comes back, stands up. Now notice when I do this, at no time when I'm doing a butt touch, do I drive my knees forward, okay? This is what we're looking at not happening. Knees driving forward, rather we're starting with the butt going posterior. So a lot of us, when we start squatting, we allow our knees to carry forward. Our momentum drives forward anteriorly towards our toes. What we're looking at doing is getting that weight shifting posteriorly. So quick little tip for you guys to do it. Try it out. Questions, comments, post it below. Otherwise, guys, we're here each and every day optimizing function to optimize performance.